Hello and welcome back to my Video Studio Pro X6 tutorial series. In this tutorial I'm going to be explaining and showing you smart proxies. So first of all click on the settings tab at the top here and then click preferences. Then go to the performance tab and you'll see it says smart proxy here. Now smart proxy basically allows you to edit your higher definition, the big files, in a smaller kind of format and what this does is allows your computer to run a lot smoother when you're editing the videos therefore making a much better user experience and it's a lot quicker when editing as well because it doesn't have to keep loading the big file so smart proxying is very good if you're using HD files so to enable it just click this little tick button here and then you can choose what resolution and what size videos you want it to create a proxy at so it will default to 1280 by 720 uh, but you can choose anything from this list here but I'm just going to keep it on that default um, and then it will also have a proxy folder, this is where it will save the proxy to um, the default will be in your documents but you can choose wherever you want for that on your computer and it will also have this which is probably defaulted which is auto generate a proxy template which is recommended so you might as well keep that ticked so that's all there is to enabling your smart proxy it's very handy like I said for when you're editing HD because it makes it a lot smoother the quality in the actual editor for the video will look reduced and not as good but when you've exported the video it'll be back in its HD format and it should look as good as it did when you originally filmed it so hopefully that's given you an idea of what smart proxy is and what it's for please stay tuned for more videos like this in the near future